Hello everyone, welcome back to the channel. I hope that everyone is doing well today. So in this video, I will be doing a super fun experiment. It's very simple, but it creates a very cool effect to demonstrate what atmospheric pressure can do. So basically guys, we will be voluntarily creating a difference in air pressure to observe a very cool effect with water. So first of all, here's what we're gonna need. A plate, a lighter, a candle, one glass, a little bit of water, not a lot as you can see, and food color. That's optional, but I like to use food color for the water to be more visible for you guys. All right, so first thing we're gonna do is take a little bit of food color. Let's take green, that's a pretty cool color, and put some in the water. We don't have a lot of water, so one drop should be enough. All right, maybe two, <laughs> two drops. So now the water has a pretty cool color. So the first thing we're gonna do is put a little bit of water in the plate, just a little bit. Not a lot. Let's just change the angle a bit so you guys have a closer view. Just green water in a plate. That's the first step. All right, now we will be taking the candle and it's very important to remove that aluminum part here to make sure that we only have the candle itself. Then we're gonna put this in the water, just like that. I know it looks kind of strange right now, guys, but Trust me, this is gonna be pretty cool. So now I'm gonna light the candle and after I'm gonna put the glass right over it and we're gonna observe a cool reaction. Something's gonna happen with the water, you'll see. So let's do this. All right, here we go. Oh my gosh, the candle is submerged. The difference of air pressure made the water go up. We basically made the pressure greater outside than inside the glass. And this is what happens with the water now. All right guys, now let's see what happens when we remove the glass. Oh, it was so sticky. Everything is perfectly intact. So I will be trying the experiment one more time with a different color. I was thinking maybe red this time. All right, so let's take everything we need. So guys, as you can see, I used a little towel here for the candle. All right, first things first. Now, let's take the red color. Oh yes, I do have red, perfect. Let's put some in the water, just like we did before. Oh, red and green, it's the holidays, so now, Let's put the water inside the plate. All right, just a little bit. This should be perfect. Now let's light the candle. Let's wait a little bit. Make sure everything is really hot. All right, this should be good. Now let's put the glass. And let's observe the reaction. No way. Is it working? Yes, it's working. Oh my gosh. This is like a vacuum effect. This is really like a vacuum because as you guys saw, there was much more water in the plate before than after. Here's the result for this second successful attempt. The water is more pink than red, but... All right, let's remove that glass now. All the water is back in the plate. All right guys, so that's it for this little experiment. Now I'm gonna have to put everything back and everything is 100% reusable after this experiment, even the candle guys. So you just take a little towel and take off the water and you can reuse that candle, no problem. I'm very happy that the experiment 
went so well because the last time I tried an experiment on the channel, it went terribly wrong. Three, two, one. <laughs> This is the worst day of my life. <laughs> so I hope that you guys all have a wonderful day and uh, I'll see you in the next video. Peace.